Now this is graphing a parabola of the form ax squared plus bx plus c with rational coefficients. Process is nothing different, the numbers just look funnier. So we're still figuring out the center by doing negative b over 2a. So b in this case is actually a positive 2 fifths and a in this case is a 1 fifth. And if I multiply this, I get negative 2 fifths. And if I multiply this, I get 2 fifths. Well, any number over itself is just 1, and a negative divided by a positive is negative. So when I create my chart, negative 1 is going to be in the center, and I need two values to the left of that, like negative 2 and negative 3, and two values to the right of that, like 0 and 1. And so all I'm doing is plugging in each number into the function. So I'm going to start with negative 3 squared plus 2 fifths times negative 3 plus 1 fifth and I get 4 fifths then I'm going to go back and now I'm going to plug in negative 2 and I get 1 fifth then I'm going to plug in 1 negative 1 and get 0 then I'm going to plug 0, so I'm going to delete that and just put 0, again delete the negative and put 0, I get 1 fifth, and then I'm going to go back and plug in positive 1 this time, and we get 4 fifths. So, in order for me to draw that, I'm going to do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's 2. And then um, 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3. Okay. So negative 3 and... Negative 3 and 4 fifths is here. Negative 2 and 1 fifth is there. Negative 1 and 0. 0 and 1 fifth. And then 1 and 4 fifths. And so you get the image that looks like this. Now, in the computer, you cannot plot these points based on your eyes and your cursor. So you do have to click that button that has like the little X so that you can plot the point. Once you plug that in, a box will come up and it'll have like a blank, parentheses, comma. You're gonna type in the negative three here, you're gonna do the fraction button and then type in the four fifths and click plot. Then keep it open, type in negative two and one fifth, click plot. Go ahead and do this one also, negative one and zero, plot. Zero and then one fifth, one over five, plot. One and four over five, plot and then exit out. Once you exit out, you should already have all five points plotted and then you can just hit the graphing icon and it'll draw the parabola for you.